This is the download from Sounds Profitable, your daily source for the essential news in the business of podcasting, brought to you by Spreaker from iHeart. I'm Gavin Gaddis, in for Tom Webster. Here's what you need to know for today, Monday, January 29th. First up, transcripts on Apple Podcasts. Apple has announced that this spring, transcripts will be added to Apple Podcasts. Every new episode published from the program's launch will be automatically transcribed by Apple. The automated transcription can be replaced with a new VTT or SRT file. Apple's automated version can also be directly downloaded by the podcaster once it's generated. James Cridland of Pod News has constructed a sizable FAQ for a number of questions asked since the announcement. While no automated transcript can be 100% perfect, transcriptions by default gives the industry an excellent baseline for accessibility. Similar to how YouTube creators can choose to hand transcribe their videos, but viewers who need captions can rely on YouTube's automatic subtitles if those bespoke captions never come to fruition. Up next from ESPN. ESPN podcasts to air weekday afternoons on ESPN2 starting January 29th. That's right. As of today, a new seasonal content initiative at ESPN will take place on the podcast to broadcast route. The new initiative will televise a video podcast episode every weekday during the 2 p.m. Eastern time slot. Podcasts included in the initial lineup are First Draft, The Hoop Collective, The Low Post, the Mina Kimes Show, and the L. Duncan Show, with each podcast getting assigned a different day, Monday through Friday. The opening slate aims to combine coverage of in-season sports and high-profile ESPN personalities. Up next, from the New York Times and Hot Pot, Doozy Podcast sued over AI-generated George Carlin impression. The estate of deceased stand-up comedian George Carlin is suing the video podcast Doozy, over a video titled George Carlin, I'm Glad I'm Dead, 2024, full special. The podcast's premise is centered around an AI character named Doozy, who runs the podcast and generates video clips based on running jokes from co-host Will Sasso and Chad Coltgen. One such generation is the focus of the lawsuit, an hour-long video comedy special starring a self-aware, AI-generated version of George Carlin. The video consists of a synthesized AI voice seemingly trained off recordings of Carlin and AI-generated images representing the topic being discussed. A spokesperson for Sasso says the doozy AI is a fictional character and the special in particular was written entirely by Coltgen. Carlin's estate says they intend to continue the lawsuit to determine just how much copyrighted material Coltgen might have fed into an AI in the creation of the special. As of Monday morning, the special has been removed from YouTube though a three-minute clip still remains in episode 87 of Doozy. As for the rest of the news, Amazon dethroned BetterHelp as top podcast spender on Magellan AI's December tracker, and Wondery debuts a new toy line inspired by kids' podcast Wow in the World. Be sure to check out all the links to every article mentioned right in your podcast listening app or at soundsprofitable.com, where you can also subscribe to the newsletter version. The download is written and produced by Brian Barletta, myself, and Tom Webster. For Sounds Profitable, I'm Gavin Gaddis. Download us tomorrow.